Well, well, well. Whoops. Better keep this door in here for lighting. Uh, let's see, should I uh, cancel intelligent contrast, uh, use low light mode, um, okay, yeah, we're, okay, we're good now. Actually, that's a bit grainy. That's a little bit better, it was still kind of cruddy, oh well. Well, look what we got here. One, two, ah, there's my third one. Just got three new lawnmowers here. Uh, two of them are 3.5 horsepower Briggs, like uh, that one over there. And then the other one is a 4 horsepower Briggs. And to me, I like the looks of these older 3.5s better than this 4.0 here. But to no avail, I haven't even tried starting them yet. Can't beat free mowers though. The guy even says they still run. Cleaning out the garage. His wife wanted him to get rid of some stuff. So, there they are. Let's see if they'll fire up. It'll be interesting to see. So, yesterday I was looking at Craigslist.com for just free stuff, and I come across these three mowers that the guy says they still even run. So I called this guy up on the phone and I says, hey, you still got those uh, three mowers um, available? Because if so, I'll come pick them up. The guy says, oh yeah, I still got them. Come and get them, man. Just please take them off my hands. I said, all right, sweet, dude. Well, I'll be over in about a half hour to get those. Okay, thanks, man. Well, you're really doing me a favor. I said, no, I thank you because you're really doing me a favor. No, I thank you. You're doing me a favor. No, you're doing me a favor. No, you. You. Okay, okay, fine, man. We're both doing each other favors. All right, yeah. Well, anyway, I'll be over to pick them up in about a half hour. All right, see ya. No, that, uh, that conversation really didn't go exactly like that, but I just thought I'd throw that in. The guy really did do me a favor, though. Sweet. Can't beat three free lawnmowers. Well, now, let's try the first one here. The one that appears to be the oldest. It's got some rust on it. The guy said it still starts and runs fine. The thing I like about this is it's got a throttle control on it. Not many of these mowers had something like that. So I think I'm just going to leave the rope starter on it for now. Later on I'll cut this off and put the drill starter on it. Check the first one here. And lo and behold, it has a little bit of gas, but I'm going to top it off. And oil. Check the oil over here. Uh, the, uh, check the air filter. The air filter's fine. I'm going to have to get a pliers to take that off. But I'll check the oil, and then we'll start it up. Well, I cannot find a primer bulb or a choke on this thing. Unless it automatically chokes when we push the throttle all the way up. So, let's just do what they say to do. Push this all the way up, and then try to start it up. Huh, wouldn't that be cool if it actually had a choke? All right. Attempt one. that it's burning a little bit of oil but not too bad it must have an automatic choke one of those that's governed by the uh, governed by the flywheel 
got a throttle on it. Even comes with a pre-installed bail bar holder. Sweet. Free lawnmower and it starts on the first pull. Forget the rust and all that, it's what's on the inside of this thing that matters. Well, I can't say Briggs and Stratton lies now when they say easy start. That sure started easy. Well, this MTD has officially taken first place for now. Time for the second one. Rally. Never heard of that brand before. And this one also has a throttle control. Yes. Oh, it's got a primer bulb. It's like the other one. Same engine, just a little bit different. Uh-oh, it doesn't say easy starting. Let's add some gas, check the oil, top off if necessary. Ooh, look at that, rusty spark plug. Well, let's see what happens here. Top off with gas and oil and try it out. Right, here we go with the second one. Prime it three times. Ooh, slow primer. One. I don't believe it! Holy cow! Doesn't adjust it very much though. <laughs> How cool is that? The starter rope didn't catch at first, but it seems like after pulling it a bit, pulling it rapidly, then it catches. Oh well, who cares? I can always use my drill start on this. Wow, that is sweet. One pull. Well, these two are tied for first place. Save the starter rope not catching on the first time. Wow, one pull. I'm starting to like Briggs now. Well, the old faithful 3.5s are sweet. Now it's time for this quantum power, four horsepower Briggs. Claims to start easily, says it's quiet. Read instructions before starting. Well, the instructions are built into me, so I don't have to do that. <laughs> Uh, this unit used to be self-propelled, I believe, but the guy said the gears were all stripped out, so he just removed the whole mechanism. Ooh, look what he gave me. A free rag. Oh, oh man, I can sure use that. That'll save me five cents. Now then, let's see here. Air filter. No primer bulb either on this one. Must be another one of those automatic choke mechanisms. I prefer a manual choke, but heck. Oh well. Let's see how it starts. Should start fine, because that other one did. Oh man. Don't need to get the gas cap that tight. Oh, gee whiz. Well, I'll top it off with gas and oil, and then we'll try to start it up. Sometimes I like to call Troy builds toy builds because they're just not all that great. But who knows, this one might do fine. Set full throttle. Ah, yeah. It is an automatic choke. Set for throttle, choke, we've got gas and oil. Here we 
we go. Oh, this thing ain't gonna make first place. Man, no automatic or a pre-installed bail bar holder. I'll have to make one. Actually, this is not an automatic choke. It's a manual choke, but it's up here. Ooh, nice slow idle. I like that. a little bit of oil but that might go away after all they are horizontal shaft engines huh I don't believe it first second and third place in the order I pulled them out started them started on two poles one pole after the starter rope grabbed and one pole with no problem at all Wow Gotta love your free mowers off Craigslist. Well, I also got this mower on Craigslist, but found out that the engine was seized. Somebody ran it on regular gasoline instead of two-cycle gasoline. Mm -mm -mm. Oh well, it'll make a good uh, engine for me to take apart. Oh, and one other thing, I should have said vertical shaft engines. I got that mixed up. Vertical is when the shaft goes up and down, like these are. Horizontal is like this engine in here, either on that generator, this power washer, the tiller, and the log splitter over there. Those are horizontal shaft engines. So I just happened to see that when I was previewing the video. So a little correction on a mistake I made there. Otherwise, nice. Three free mowers. Well, we can have some fun with these. I don't need the mower decks or anything, so I can just take these engines off, modify them, take the governors off, and see if I can increase the horsepower output. Sweet. Thank you, Craigslist.